So for deleting the user from the database, so let's again go to the user controller here. And at the bottom, so let me just simply create a, a function called delete user. So just type export and just simply type const delete user. And let's make it asynchronous with the request and response parameter. And inside here, again, just type try catch. So just try catch and just simply uh, copy this from from here and just simply paste here and inside the try block so we will again just uh, provide this id from the parameter so just simply copy this one from here and paste inside here so we will also check if the user doesn't exist with that specific id so we will just display the message something like user not found so if any user exists with that specific id so we will just uh, delete that id so just simply type something like await and just type user dot find by id so we'll just use this method called find by id and delete and we will just simply provide the id inside here and in response so we'll just type response dot status so we will just uh, provide the status code 200 okay and just type the json and in json so we will just uh, provide the message something like user deleted successfully so let me just save this one and again go to the user route and here similarly we'll just type route and the http method will be delete so just type delete and you can just simply uh, type something like delete slash user slash colon id and just type delete user from the user controller and make sure to import here so just simply save this one and so this has automatically reformatted from this uh, prettier so once this is done, so now we should be able to delete our data from the database. So for delete, so we will just create a new request. So let me just click here and click on add request. So instead of this get, so we will just choose delete. And here, so let me just click here and we just have to uh, type delete user. And so we, we, we can see the user ID. Uh, so if I just click on send, so this will say something like the user deleted successfully. And so if I just now go into the MongoDB compass here and reload, so this would have deleted one of the uh, data from here. So let me just reload so you can see it. So this has deleted this one. So now if I just click again, send here, so this would show user not found. So since we have saved this error message, user not found inside here. So this is how you can delete the user data from the database.